Greetings and salutations from Evelyn O'Malley, Lady of the Realm, to oh, my favorite pet YouTuber, or one of my favorite YouTubers here, Jacqueline Gwynn. And if anything, this video is more in reference to. Sorry, I need to move the camera a bit. I swear. Was moves where I don't want it to. But, anyways reference to your video that you made the other day. Now, you don't know me, but I know you kind of thing, as I am one of your subscribers. I also have my own YouTube channel, well, which I will link in the description below, that you can see one of my videos. I don't know if you'll think I'm very smart or not, or very good, but, um, I just have a few things to say about Christianity. And yes, I do think you're probably right. We are about the same Christians as the Westboro Baptist Church that people are. We probably are. However, I hope Maybe we've made an effort, or some people, and it's not saying that you you don't know any nice Christians or whatever. That that's besides the point. You know, it, it doesn't matter how many nice Christians there are out there. There are probably one too many out there who suck. All right, and you're right. And we have a lot to apologize for. And I personally feel yes. yes. I think we should applaud, we, we Christians should probably make up for some of the things we say to, or about the Jewish faith, but see that, uh, unfortunately, Hitler was Christian. It's not saying we're going to become like Hitler. That, that's one of the issues I have with the video. It's not, you know, I agree with you 100% that you know, yes, religion, no matter how we look at it, is about the same thing. It's just like, if I compare Harry Potter to this, which is about the same exact thing. Fantasy, whatever, chosen ones, whatever, children, whatever. But, you have to give, I will definitely say as a Christian, and not because I think I'm a better Christian or anything, but I would hope to say or think that I have, I would hope if anyone follows me or subscribes to me, that they understand that I am a Christian. Yes, I believe in God and all that stuff. However, I do not agree with what he did in the Bible originally. And I do see your point. As you see, a uh, thing can be said about what the uh, amazing atheist said last night about Chris Christmas. You know, should we Christians really celebrate Christmas? Personally, I'm kind of in, at odds with that too. But, you know, I, for one, have been a most good hearted, reasonable possibly moderate Christians. I mean, that's the better term to use, but I do not feel like, and you're probably right, they're radical Christians. I mean, uh, sorry. you're probably right. There is no difference. We are Christians. We, we believe in the same thing. It's just that they decided to follow the, the Bible to the letter. Okay. You know, the literal, literal meaning. While me and my mother, who happen to be Christians, are more moderates, and we follow the Bible more to a less of a T. Like we we believe Jesus Christ came and died on the cross was for our sins and all that stuff. And part of me doesn't really want to give a Christianity, you know, not because oh, why I want to hate the gays or anything, but it's because, in a way, 
I have been raised this way, and it's, you know, old habits die hard, sort of thing, but I promise you I'm not one of those, well, I'm not doing those things, okay? I'm not going out and protesting against homosexuality, like, yes, yes, down with, down with homosexuality or other things like that, no. And I don't want to be that time for, I, I don't want to practice my Christianity that way. I just hope you're open to the idea that, yeah, I mean, even the, there are Christians out there who do not hate homosexuality, and then that's okay, and, you know, but I, I'm sorry I'm making such a fail of a video, but, you know, I, I'm not trying to push you to do it any more than I am, I just feel like, and I don't think you hate Christianity, I don't think you hate on Christians at all, I think you're just making a point and people just don't agree with it. And you, I don't think you deserve the whole, God, don't, no, you have the right to make your point of view and your opinion. And I just, I'm sorry that I, that that's how you feel, and you know, about religion, I'm sorry. I know, unfortunately, there are a lot of people who happen to be atheists. Yes. And I've unfortunately had to put up with that too, and or just happen to be atheist. I feel just fine with you being atheist, whatever. It's not hurting me, it's not hurting you. I don't see why people make such a big deal out of it. But I will be honest, I was kind of hurt. I'm not going to lie, that I don't swear any vengeance upon you. I just kind of feel like, yeah, but what if you are that kind of Christian? And, you know, you're not, you don't want to lash out on anyone, but you don't really think that way. You know, you don't think that God is going to, you know, punish me or anything, punish you or anything for believing in entirely different beliefs. And in fact, I think you're a brilliant person because you believe what you believe, and you stood by it. But whenever I think about this sort of thing, too, it kind of makes me feel bad, just knowing that there are Christians who do this willingly, and are horrible to people, and really think God hates something that he himself created. Because, in my opinion, you know what that means. He probably doesn't like you either. Because, um, you said God created man, right? And I've lived all around our society, and uh, I know most people don't feel really uncomfortable about this, but if you look at some of the things we do here in this country, um, in other countries, we'd all be gay. It's not even a joke. That's really kind of like, yeah, you know, we're gonna, if we're going to point fingers at someone, we should be pointing at ourselves. Because also, we really shouldn't have the stereotypes in the first place, and it doesn't matter that much anyways. Or that, yeah, that, or the other way, but... Sorry that this video devolved into that, but I just think about it, and I'm sorry to you as a person who happens to be an atheist that you've had to deal with hateful Christians. Um, I hope you begun the healing and you get past that and maybe one day, maybe, you know, just, or, and, and not so much become Christian again, but just not have to deal with that anymore. You know, maybe one day they, we won't have it on our money anymore, we won't have it and the Pledge of Allegiance to the United States of America, you know, that stuff. I want those gone. I want that gone. It shouldn't have been there in the first place, which, since our forefathers didn't want it there in the first place, so... 
few of my pet peeves of the Christian faith, no matter what it is, but, yeah, that's all I really have to say, and, uh, thank you for making the video, and I am very sorry for those Christians, and, anyways, see ya! And again, I'm sorry for this video for being so long. I don't know what it is with me and making long videos. It seems to be a constant thing. Anyways, bye.